Hey everyone, this is Music Tech Help Guy, and welcome to another Logic Pro Quick Tip tutorial. In this video, I'm gonna show you kind of a hidden, lesser known feature in Logic called the Marquee Ruler. And I think you'll really like this editing feature, especially when you're working with really high track counts. So just about everyone is familiar with the Marquee Tool. It's essentially a selection tool, so you can use it to drag across multiple tracks or single tracks. For example, if I wanted to copy this entire verse section here, I could just drag over everything, hit Command C, then I could jump over to this empty verse section here, and then I could set the playhead where I want it, press Command V to paste, and I'm done. However, there is a faster way to do this. If you go up to View, and then go down to Tracks, there's an option here called Marquee Ruler. Now when you click on this, this will show an additional small ruler below the main ruler. And what this does is it functions like an extension of the marquee tool, but it automatically selects all of the tracks in your project. So this is why I was saying it's incredibly helpful for when you have large track counts and you don't wanna to have to drag and drag all the way down, especially if your project is zoomed out a bit vertically, or maybe you've got some of your folders and track stacks open like this. This is where the marquee ruler can be really helpful. So now what I can do is I can just drag over that section. It selects everything in my project at that section. I'll press Command C to copy, click on the background to deselect, set the playhead where I wanna paste in, Command V to paste. So obviously there's a ton of different situations this can be used for, but especially if you're working with high track count projects where maybe you have 30, 50, 60 tracks or more, it can be kind of difficult to select everything in a certain section and copy and paste it and move it around. Now, I know someone will ask, well, why not just use the cut insert time functions? So what, the way I used to do this is I would make a cycle range or locator selection, and then I'd go up to edit, and then I'd go down to cut insert time, and I'd say copy section between locators, and then I'd come over here to the section I wanna paste this in at. I'd set the playhead there at bar 84, and I could just press Command V again to paste it in, and it would work the exact same way. It just takes a little bit longer than using the marquee ruler. Now, another great thing about this is you don't actually have to have the marquee tool selected to use the marquee ruler. So if I have the scissors tool selected, for example, I can drag right over this, Command C to copy. I can come over here to my empty verse, set the playhead right there at the beginning of the verse, and then paste it in. But there is one little tricky thing you have to be aware of. You have to be very cognizant of whether you're making a selection with the playhead or if you're making a selection on the marquee ruler. If I just make a selection on the marquee ruler and paste this in, it'll go to the correct horizontal position, but it's not necessarily going to go to the correct vertical position. See how these are all the way up here? This is a vocal track and the guitar is on the vocal track. These are supposed to be down here. So when you copy and paste, make sure that you're setting the playhead in the correct position, then pasting to make sure that you get the correct vertical position. So that's the marquee ruler. It's a really helpful editing function in Logic for copying and pasting regions and when working with really high track counts. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. As always, thank you for the support and thanks for watching.